Let's see what we unlock. Let's go. Greetings guys, this is Stokecraft, and welcome back to another video on the channel. Firstly, I hope you guys had an amazing Christmas, I certainly did, and I hope you guys had an amazing time with your friends and family. But uh, this time, it is time for a video on the Holiday Ops boxes. As you can see, I've invested in 25 of them, because I really wanted to experience these myself. I've seen a lot of videos on these Holiday Ops boxes appear on YouTube in the last few weeks, and I really wanted to experiences for myself because it really seems like a nice experience and also it seems like you can get a little bit more bang for your buck if, uh, with regards to gold and premium time out of this because let's be honest the holiday season is pretty much the only time when i get to play world of tanks pretty much actively so to have a little bit of premium time and gold to speed up my progress is always a nice thing right so let's see what 25 of these holiday ops boxes will get me firstly we will open these boxes and afterwards, I will show you guys the exact value of the amount of stuff I've gotten. Uh, and see if I made any profit, so to say. I know you can get premium tanks from these boxes as well. I will pretty much not expect to get any of those. I'll just want pretty much aiming for the gold, to be honest. So, let's take a look what we will get. Alright everyone, I think that is quite enough of talking. Let's go and get right into these loot boxes. We've got 25 of them and let's see what this will get me. So, congratulations. You have bought boxes and therefore I need to be congratulated, right? Oh, <laughs> immediately the highest amount of gold we can get. What the hell? That is really nice. Wow. Wow. Immediately the highest amount of gold. I didn't expect that whatsoever. I really do like these animations too. And if there's the first premium day, which is nice. I hope to get like 14 days of premium, if that's possible. Because that's perfectly enough to be able to uh, play World of Tanks with premium account throughout my whole holiday season. Which is nice. Let's see what we are next. Go. No way. We actually got a tier 8 premium. That is freaking... No way! What the f***? Oh my god. Oh my god. I didn't expect that. That's my third one. That's my third box. What? Well, it's. I think it's safe to say we've already made back our money, right? But this is... This is just a gamble. I didn't... I didn't even think about getting a tier 8 premium. That's ridiculous. Oh my god. Wow. I kind I kind of wanna I kind of wanna see it now. We also get 250 gold. That's amazing. Okay, I'm gonna check it out real quick. I. Oh my god, that is actually ridiculous. I just got a Patriot, pretty much. One of the best premium tanks you can get. Holy shit! Yeah, unfortunately, it doesn't come with the crew. I expected nothing less, but. Um... Holy shit! Wow! <laughs> I'm so happy now. What the hell? Okay. Oh my god, that's ridiculous. Okay, let's open a few more, man. A few more, he says. A few more, he says. That's ridiculous, man. Nice, another premium day. Oh, wow. This is really nice, especially if you get good stuff. I'm really happy about that. Another premium day. Very nice. If we if we keep going like this, then... Uh, then I think I'll, um, I'll get enough. Oh! 100,000 credits. Oh, that is nice. Oh, the credits are probably one of the things I need the most in this game, so... No complaining whatsoever, man. That's ridiculous. Oh, that's... What oh, just? Oh, my God. We've almost got it off already. What the f***? Oh, my God. That's ridiculous. Seven days of premium. What's that worth? It's a, isn't it like 250 gold for, for one premium day or so? If I'm not mistaken? So that's a lot. That's a lot of gold in one in one of these boxes. That's ridiculous, man. Wow. Oh, we got some inscriptions this time. What is this? Merry Christmas inscription on any vehicle. Oh, any map, I mean. Group special. Yeah, okay. Suitable for vehicles. British vehicles. And for the... We got the same one for the US vehicles. Oh, that's nice. And again, another premium day. 
I'm not complaining whatsoever. That's very nice, guys. Oh my god. Wow. That's ridiculous. Oh, that's still above average, I guess. That's, that's like 250 gold extra. I think the minimum you can get is like 250 gold. And yeah, some decorations as well. Nothing special in here. At least we didn't get like the minimum one. <laughs> right? Ooh, another very meaty one. Oh my god. Wow. 1,250 gold in one of these boxes. Jesus Christ. Wow. Jesus. We got another tank. We got one of the tier fours. Yes. Oh, wow. Isn't that the T28 with like a... Like an 85 millimeter or something like that? I don't even know. That's amazing. Wow. I want to check that out too. Oh my god. I, I, I just have to... I just have to look at my tanks whenever I get one. Oh my god. No, that's, that's not the premium variant, is it? Oh, here it is. <laughs> you stupid. Oh, wow. What the hell? Oh my god. It has so many crew members. We've already got, like, almost enough premium. Oh my god, that's amazing, everyone. Holy crap. I don't think I could have gotten any more lucky than this already. This is ridiculous, man. Okay, let's continue, guys. Two premium tanks and 25 boxes. One of them is a tier 8 premium. That is actually ridiculous. Another average one. Eh, 500 still good. So, yeah, I'm still happy with that. I think I'll calculate afterwards what like the average amount of uh, amount of gold is what I need to get to be able to earn back my money. Still one day premium again, very nice. Not complaining whatsoever. This is exactly what I wanted to get. So uh, another one. Oh my god, we got the Seal Club tank, like the B2, right? Isn't that the B2? Oh my god, what is happening? Oh my god, we got the Seal Club tank. <laughs> oh no. Well, it's a free tank anyways. I'm not complaining, but... I'm not I'm not even sure how, how broken this tank is. I have to experience that for myself. But from what I've heard and watching other YouTubers' videos, this thing apparently is incredibly broken. So, I guess we continue again. Let's see what we get. In, is, I think it's like 11 boxes remaining. So, we, we still got a lot of stuff left. Another premium day. Very, very nice. Oh my god. Let's see what we get in this one. Oh yes, 100,000 credits. That's always nice to get. Oh my god, that's amazing. 100,000 credits. This is getting addictive. <laughs> that's probably what Wargaming wants you uh, to do, right? They want you to keep buying boxes and just keep opening these forever. Oh. And again, one premium day is very nice, so I'm not complaining whatsoever. Oh, yes, 100,000 credits again. Seems like we're gonna be buying like a tier 8 or maybe a tier 9 tank this holiday season. If I do find the time to be able to grind them. Another premium day, very nice, not complaining. Oh my god, this is so nice. Especially if you get like a very nice surprise in between, right? Oh, that's exactly what I mean. <laughs> 500,000 credits. It's like half a million credits, that's so nice. Oh my god. Oh, wow. That's a, that's an amazing one right there. Oh, my God. 100,000 credits once again. Just stop it. Stop it. <laughs> oh, man. And another premium day. 250 gold. Amazing stuff. I think we got, like, more than 14 days already. So, this is, this is like, the perfect amount of gold what I would get. 100,000. So, there's two more. Let's see what we get. Two more of these beautiful boxes. Another 100,000 credits. What is happening right now? So, we got one more remaining. Let's see what we get. Hopefully, not a premium time or some credits. That would be nice. We'll see what happens. And we get, like, an average one to stop on 500 gold. Ah, could be worse, I guess. Again, I will probably calculate what the average amount of gold in, uh, in one of these boxes would be to be able to earn back my money. But that's it, man. Okay, I think it is time to take a look at what my amount of yeah, money that I got, so to say, is. Let's take a look.
Here are the results of the 25 loot boxes. What I did is determine the amount items I obtained in the loot boxes. For each item I determined the gold value and I summed these up to get a total. Quickly to review, all items together gave me a gold value of 28,300 according to the Wargaming Premium Shop. That equals 93.52 euros. For these 25 loot boxes, I paid 39 euros and 99 cents. So I think it's pretty safe to say we made a profit right there. I also wanted to see if we would make a profit even without all the premium tanks. So that's what I have done in the lower side of this overview. As we can see, even without the premium tanks, we get a total gold value of 50,250. And according to the Wargaming Premium Shop, that is 52 euros and 84 cents. So even without all the premium tanks, we made a profit. When looking at this overview, you're going to have to know two things. Firstly, one gold equals 400 credits. This statistic was used to convert the amount of gain in credits to a gold value. We gained 1.1 million credits during this loot box opening. If you divide that by 400, that gives you a gold value of 2,750. The last note you can see refers to the way I have calculated the gold worth of the amount of premium days. I have not just summed up the amount of premium days and then multiplied it by the gold value of one premium day which is 250 gold what i did is i looked at the amount of single premium days i got and the amount of times i got seven days of premium because if we take a look at the pricing of the premium days in the world of tanks clients we can see that seven days of premium actually costs less than seven times one day of premium so keep that in mind I calculated the amount of gold specified for the amount of premium time I got in each of the loot boxes. With this I mean that for one day of premium I calculated using 250 gold. This is the pricing of one premium day. And for the 7 days of premium I used the 1250 gold which is the pricing of 7 days of premium in the world of tanks client. And for those interested I also calculated the minimum amount of gold you would need to get in each of the loot boxes if you want to get a profit. If you buy the 25 loot boxes pack like I did, you need at least 350 gold. This number is only valid for the 25 boxes pack. As compared to a 25 boxes pack, a 75 boxes pack costs less. This means that the average amount of gold you would need to get in each box to run a profit goes down. For the 75 boxes pack, you at least need to get around 170 gold which means that you pretty much run a profit with every box you open as the minimum amount you can get in a box is 250 gold all right guys to end this video i've got three bonus boxes for you they were gifted to me by bob underscore 50 probably one of my best viewers of all time he also gifted me i think an su 100 y for my birthday last year or this year i'm not quite sure but anyway he hopes i get lucky thank you very much bob and we'll see if your boxes are going to get me something really amazing. I'm really thankful in it anyway. Because I got really lucky already. I got the tier 8 premium. So I've got nothing to complain about. Let's see. Three more bonus boxes for me right here. Uh, pretty mediocre one for the beginning. Two more to go though. No worries. This is pretty much a gift to me. So I can't complain in any way, shape or form. Very nice. A premium day and some gold. Nice addition to the garage. And the very last box we will be opening is this one. And we get a pretty mediocre one again. 750 gold. Thank you very much, Bob, for these three bonus boxes. And also I'd like to thank you guys for watching. If you liked this video, please make sure you leave a like. Because I did put a lot of time into making this video. And I also really did enjoy to make this video for you. I really enjoyed jumping into the statistics and all the the calculations to see if you actually made a profit out of this but for now that's it please consider subscribing as i really appreciate it and i'll see each and every one of you in the next video bye guys